I just want to first start off by saying this is not a good idea. What are Lockbuster keys, and why did I provide such a strong warning first thing in the video? A Lockbuster key is a key that is designed to permanently disable a lock. When you compare it to the key that opens up this lock, you're going to see a few distinct differences. So the key on the very top here is the key that opens up the lock, and it has some very gentle slopes on it. This key is designed to be able to insert into the lock, slide over the key pins, and make it so that you can get the key in and out of the lock very easily. If you need a stronger review on how a pen and tumbler lock works, please check out my video number 247. When you further look at the Lockbuster key, compared to the key that opens up this lock, you can see it has slopes on the front that are designed to slide the key right into the lock. However, the slopes are hooking back, which is going to make it so once the key is inserted, it's not going to be able to be retracted. A Lockbuster key is designed to be inserted into the lock, make it so that the key is not going to be able to be removed, and this is going to permanently disable the lock because the Lockbuster key is going to be physically obstructing the keyway. You're not going to be able to get a key into the lock. It's going to make it so the lock is not going to be able to be opened up. This is a very powerful tool, but you never want to use a Lockbuster key on a lock that you use. You always need to use them on only locks that you own and locks that you are willing to take full responsibility on. Because if you use this, you are going to break your lock and you just need to be very careful. What I'm going to do next is show you a very close-up shot of the Lockbuster key being used in action. As you can see, the Lockbuster key has now been inserted into the lock and it's going to make it so the key is not going to be able to be removed and it is permanently lodged inside of the lock. All of the key pins are lifted up in a way that is going to prevent the lock from being open because we are very clearly not at the shear line. So what happens when I try to remove this key is you're going to see that it's stuck. It has all of the cuts in the key that hook back and it makes it so that I cannot get this key out. You can see that I am really tugging on it here and I am not making too much progress to get this key out. This lock has now been permanently seized up. The Lockbuster key is going to remain in this lock and I am going to just try to be very vigilant about warning everyone that if you are ever going to utilize one of these, use it with extreme caution. You are going to break your lock. But this is how the Lockbuster keys work, and I feel like this was a pretty fun video to make. If you guys have any questions or suggestions, please leave them in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more like it, please subscribe. As always, thank you so much for checking out this video, and I hope you all have a great day, and just thank you so much for checking this out.